I wanted to make this video because I used to talk about something funny from my childhood, and that is a movie that gave me panic attacks. And the reason why it's funny is because the movie is so, like, not panic attacky inducing it shouldn't induce panic attacks it's actually a really well done movie it's, it's actually like it's it has its serious moments and it has its like funny moments it's not supposed to, i mean it also, it also has its like moments that are all pretty fucking scary but that movie is men in black men in black used to scare the hell out of me as a kid and the reason being that giant ass bug like scared the life ever loving fuck out of me and what's scared me the most is when the like when the bug crash lands on the form and the, the like former guy goes out to uh, to to like check it out, and then he gets killed, and his body gets like taken over and shit like that. They used to give me major panic attacks, and it really uh it really isn't a given because everything gave me panic attacks as a kid. It was actually hit or miss whether Ryan was gonna have a panic attack or not based on what movie we were gonna watch. Like not, not even kidding, but uh, I know I did a movie earlier. A few, a few months ago, about Jeepers Creepers giving me a panic attack. And yeah, that one did. This is another movie that gave me a panic attack. And of course, it's Men in Black. And I remember one incident. We were, we were backyard camping. Camping in the backyard about 10 feet from our house. Not even kidding. Like 10 feet from our house. It was tent, a few feet of uh, lawn, and then back door into the nice, shiny, bright, lit up, warm safety of my home. And we had a portable D uh, DVD player, portable TV in the tent. And we started watching Men in Black. And it was me and my older brothers. And it was I, I know for a fact my older brothers always got frustrated. Because my panic attacks always started with me hyperventilating. It always started with a little bit of a... <sighs> I, and, and then it would just be... And, 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 and like I got to the point where it's just... You know, you'd roll your eyes and just get all pissed off. Because now I'm ruining a perfectly good fucking moment. So... <laughs> We're still, we're still watching it, and we got, you know, however many minutes in until the uh, crash landing scene happens. And we're watching it, and I'm sitting already, like, on the edge of my seat, or the edge of my sleeping bag, just staring at it, and staring at the TV, and just staring intently at it. And my brothers are just, you know, watching it, chilling, having fun. And then the scene happens, and the guy gets fucking yoinked, and... Literally, I see, I see you know, the floodgates open and a panic attack for it came. It happened. It, it happened. And I'm, I'm, I think about it every now and then. And my God, I, it upsets me. Because now I can watch movies a lot and not get scared. It took a lot of growing up. But I <laughs> I watch movies now and I don't get panic attacks. I watch the movie now and I don't get panic attacks. But I got to the point where like I was freaking out. But like my brothers couldn't get me to go inside because it was dark outside. Despite the fact that like, the tent was being lit up from the house, from the lights of the house. Because, again, we're, like, 10 feet from our house. We weren't even that far away. Um, so my brother said to go get my dad, who was inside playing on his computer. And I, I, I know my family, like, really loves me. But I also know, as a kid, I probably annoyed the fuck out of him with the amount of anxiety I had. So, sorry for all of that. It's frustrating, I know. So my, my, uh, my, my dad had to come out and carry me inside because... And now, 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 I'm going to say this right now. I was, like, six. So that should give me a little bit of leniency with uh, the whole with that whole thing at the very least. I think, I don't know. Maybe it doesn't. I don't know. But so my dad carried me inside, and then spent like the better half of an hour trying to get me to calm down and convince me that that wasn't gonna happen to me because that's what anxiety did to me. It was like, oh my god, that's gonna fucking happen to me. The, the aliens in the crash land in our backyard, and I'm gonna fucking get taken. And you know, my dad, and my mom, I just spent like. But I have a fucking hour, maybe two hours. I don't even know. Anxiety makes you feel, anxiety makes time move slow and fast at the same time. So I don't fucking know. But so so that happened, and I managed to get calmed down. But that's not the only event of that night. Not the only event of that night. Um, my older brother was out running around because he had a friend over, and they were out running around, and he happened to step on one of the stakes that were in the uh, that was in the ground. That was holding the tent. And it went through his foot. So it was a bad night to be my parents. Because they had to spend the better half of uh, an hour. Two hours. Coming me down from a shitty fucking panic attack. And then rushing my brother to the ER. Because he stepped on a steel stake. And it went through his foot. So that's uh. It was it was wild. Childhood was wild a lot. Causing my parents a lot of stress. So that was a. That was a very uh, unique night. To say the least. We've never had a night like that. My brother made a full recovery. I still had a, I think I, it took me longer to recover from the anxiety attack than it took him to recover from stepping on a steel stake and going through his foot. So, um, pretty eventful night. I got, Men in Black just gave me anxiety. It, it really did. And honestly, that single night is really just a night of like terror 
for six year old me because like when you when you watch your dad kill your other brother inside because he's bleeding from the foot, that's just like, god damn it! It's so it's so it, it's 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 crazy. It is so crazy. It's 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 wild. But Man in Black just gave me a panic attack. And to this day, I can watch it and enjoy it, no problem. But I'll just think about me having a panic attack and me freaking out 10 feet away from my house. And it makes me just kind of cringe a little bit because I'm like, God. Like, I got to the point where like, mo a lot of movies did give me panic attacks. Not a lot of movies, but some movies gave me panic attacks, gave me anxiety. That it was, it would always be, well, what, if we, can we watch this movie? It was this movie going to give Ryan anxiety. And it would be like a hit or miss, like trial and error. You had to find out what wouldn't make me freak out. Um, so I don't know, but it was just funny story from childhood. Um, it's really just kind of unique to you. I don't know if Men in Black was that scary for a lot of people. I'm actually curious if anyone else got terrified of that movie too. I know there's a lot of just, you know, weird movies, you know, movies that aren't even scary or made to be scary that, you know, do cause a lot of, you know, childhood trauma or not even a lot, just a night of a few hours of trauma at the very least but that's what i want to talk about in this video just a funny story from childhood i hope you guys all enjoyed have a good day thank you so much for watching and as always stay awesome